I'm here. Standing at the corner with the Bible in your hand, you're walking up to me and cause you don't know where I stand. Gotta fill me in with the fundamental laws, you silly little Christian, let me tell you about God. Hello, we're at the path of the speed and jealous fuck. What's up, meatballs? Mr. Meat Hook here. For real this time. If you watched the video from earlier today, you know that started out not me. Anyways, um, I don't have a bad joke of the day. I already told you one today, right? I don't have another one. Sorry. Um, time for unboxing my favorite box. Fright Crate. This one is gigantic because Jay was sent the wrong boxes. Um, this month there is Nightbreed, Reanimator, Text Chainsaw Massacre 2, They Live, Child's Play, um, Adam's Family Values, one in every three boxes gets a gizmo item, and then uh, ten boxes, half of them are YouTuber boxes, will get a Universal Monsters item. And then five boxes, only two of those for YouTubers will get an upgraded Chucky item. I haven't watched any unboxings yet, so I don't know which ones are which. So, yeah. Anyways. Right, great. There's usually a quote on the side. Not this month. That's fine. I'm more concerned about the contents anyways. Every one that I've seen. I have not seen any unboxings. Unfortunately, one YouTuber did post one of the items as their profile picture on Facebook. I'm not going to put them on blast. That's just not me. But, yeah, unfortunately one item got spoiled for me. So that's open now. Everyone's been saying this is the best box yet. Okay. Open the box and you get paper. Big ball of paper. There goes the cat after the paper. Okay, well, the, I found the item that got spoiled for me already. It's still pretty cool. It's they Live Sunglasses. I've come here to chew bubble gum and kick ass, and I'm all out of bubble gum. These are definitely not something you want to wear outside because it's pretty freaking hard to see out of these, but they're cool nonetheless. I like them. What do we got here? Something with a certificate of authenticity. This month's Fright Crate, we are pleased to present you the celebrity autograph of Ed Gale, known for his portrayal of Chucky in the movie Child's Play. If you receive a golden autograph in your box, you get a Skype call with Ed Gale. That is fucking awesome. So now I open it and see what I got. Okay, I just get the standard one, but that's very cool. So he is the voice of the Chucky doll itself. The, hi, I'm Chucky, wanna play? Very fucking cool. I was a little concerned about the Chucky item because I'm not a huge Child's Play fan. I, I enjoy the movies, but there's definitely a series that I enjoy more, but that's, that's really cool. Very, very cool. So thanks for that, Jay. Oh, I know there's also supposed to be an art print with uh, from Scott Straka in this box. And here it is. Oh, yeah. That's fucking sick as shit. Herbert West Reanimator. Scott Straka print. Signed and numbered. Number 229. 250. Oh. Reanimator is one of my guilty pleasures. I mean, we all know that technically... It's not actually a good movie. It's actually a pretty cheesy movie, but it's so awesome. I've loved all three of these items so far. I, I No, get out of the box, cat. Come on. Come on now. You're not supposed to be in there. I So far, I'd have trouble picking a favorite item. The shirt in my lap. It feels like it's a lot of paper this month, but that's okay because paper can be cool. Holy fucking hell. Oh my god. 
That is fucking amazing. Chop Top from Texas Chainsaw Massacre 2 as a fucking pen. Number 31 out of 300. Oh shit, that's, that's badass. I, I, I couldn't pick a favorite item yet. What do we got here? An Adams Family Values bookmark with a fucking film cell in it. At first I was going to say a bookmark, well that's kind of lame, but that's got a fucking film cell in it. Holy shit. Can't really get a good look at it, but yeah. That's awesome. That's another item that I wasn't too crazy about because I'm not a big fan of Adams Family movies. I liked the old TV show, although personally I was more of a Musters person myself. Um, the artist on Etsy is Blue Tiger Art. Okay, May preview. Usually it's a big piece of paper, this time it's just a little one, but that's fine. Got Stephen King's It, Day of the Dead, Terror Vision, and Dexter. Like all four of those, although honestly, I personally think it's a little overrated. Tim Curry's portrayal was okay, not great. And uh, I don't know if the movie's just kind of shitty. Even for like early 90s TV miniseries, it's still pretty bad. What do we got here? Okay, that's everything in the box. So that means the t-shirt's gonna be Nightbreed, and that's cool. And, oh, yes. Fucking Decker t-shirt. That's, that's good, that's, yeah. Last month I gave my shirt away because I didn't really care for it. This is sick as shit. Oh my God. Oh yeah. This is some good stuff, guys. So to recap, Decker t-shirt from Nightbreed. Looks like I didn't get any of the upgraded items or the special insert items, but that's okay. You know, whatever. They live sunglasses. This amazing fucking pen. This shit. This might be my favorite item out of here. Adam's Family Values bookmark with a film cell. Ed Gale autograph. And a badass Scott Straka reanimator print. So guys, that's going to be all for this week. This box. A little bit of news. Um, as soon as BAM box gets shipped out and I get that. Uh, Fright Craze only box I'm getting next month. I got to go see my daughter graduate from high school. Got to fly out to Michigan to, for that from California. So, yeah, I'm making the right decision, obviously. Um, Got to put my finances into that instead of boxes. But I'll be back July with, hopefully, with an, an opening fest 2017. Um, before then, I will have an unboxing of a couple of birthday presents because my birthday pre my birthday's coming up this month. Um, anyways, if you like the video, click the like button, the dick like a chick. Stay cool, stay sexy. It's just like me.